February 18th, 2009. Progress on the Springhouse Railroad is coming along nicely. Bench work's pretty much complete. There is a little wiring to do. But all the main structure is in. We managed to get both turntables working. We tried the 7686 uh, digital controller. Seems to have problems with that thing. We opted out of that, installed the old board, the manual controllers. They come with the turntable, and they seem to work perfect, actually. Back to the basics. We installed the second turntable under here in the shadow yard. There's the one helix coming down. There's seven runaround track, uh, seven storage tracks, and the two outside tracks, other uh, runaround tracks. We installed rope lights all along underneath. Give it a nice evening glow. There's the second helix under down to the staging, shadow yard. Put that all along the bottom. Nice for long run. Bridges, you got the deck girder bridge here with the arch spans. A nice faller kit right there, that's a really neat kit. About four foot long. In this section, we'll have a, a mountain coming up. The track stuck behind it, there'll be a large cut back here. The raised city in the back. The coal crane is operational. The glass dome station shed. <coughs> Small yard. With the engine terminal. This section here will be a little more rural. Have a mountain going back in there. Going to start working on that later today. Once the electrical is straightened out. Going up a hill. And across the Deck Curter Bridges, nice river, behind the large bridge there will be a waterfall dropping down into the river, That's a cool ice train, Markland, and over here we have the Trans Euro. This section here will have the large factory. It's a Faller kit. Oh no, I'm sorry, it's Cabri. It had uh, four buildings and then also a kit for the fencing around it, and the gates. Got the powerhouse here. It's a nice kit. I do have the hoist house done. It's not here, unfortunately. Installing some more lights. This is part of the hoist house, the actual. That'll span here across the tracks. Very nice kit. <coughs> Got the supply shed, lumber shed in this section here. Plan on putting a little station right in this section with a, a crossover for the passengers. It's considered that's a, the station for the large factory. Up in this section here, the mountain will come up. The mountain will come up in here. We'll have a small town with a road dropping down, running along behind the factory and across. Eventually running across the river here. Going across this double section of mains and over to the city or wherever it might duck into, disappear. Uh, having trouble getting this crossover to work. It's Marklin. 
uh, here's the instructions. The number is uh, 74920, 74930, railroad grade crossing. We hook it up the way it go it's supposed to. For some reason it's not working out. The gates don't come on, the lights don't flash. Any feedback on that would be appreciated because eventually I'd like to get the double track. I'd like to get a single track going at least and then do it, make it into a double track. This is just our test section here. Eventually that will be in this spot. I'll try and fit it in that spot. That'd be a nice spot to go. So that's progress so far. Got a lot done. Finally going to start on the scenery today. Actual forms for the mountains and everything. Any feedback be appreciated. Thanks for watching.